grooms to be. Listen up. Are you a great groom or are you a clueless? <laughs> Either way, Dee Allen from the Bridal Box is here to help. Thank you for joining us, Dee. Uh, so apparently, from what I understand, there's more to the groom's duties than just, <laughs> hey, you have Showing to be up. here at a certain time. There are, but there's a lot of grooms who don't know what they're supposed to do, uh -huh. and some of them are get angry if you don't include them. Oh, huh. you okay. know, so they kind of put a halt to that right away. But then there's yeah. other grooms who just really want to know. I th I would say most grooms <laughs> kind of just don't want to be involved. I had a friend though. Now let me ask this: Can a groom be too involved? Like I had a friend whose groom had a very strong opinion on the bridesmaid dress color, all kinds of things, oh. and she was like. This is my wedding. Are there I, I, boundaries, <laughs> maybe? <laughs> I personally would set boundaries, but okay. there's there's some brides who, who enjoy that involvement, um, but I don't care for it. <laughs> but, and I know that there are a lot of other uh, brides who don't So care no for going either, into so. it rather than, you know, the big well, fight after the ceremony. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and I just... Th I would prefer, as a groom, watching my bride come down, not knowing what dress she picked out. You know, Ex yeah, sort of exactly. Thing. So, what are some common things, though, that grooms should know that they are responsible for, or that they should be involved with? The most important thing that grooms need to do is look good on your wedding day. If you don't know the mm. difference between brown and green, set some time aside <laughs> uh, with your bride to go pick out. one brown sock and one green sock. You'd be amazed. <laughs> <laughs> I have a story about that, but we don't have time today for to that. <laughs> so they, they need to look good. So I'm guessing don't get a haircut a, the day before the wedding. No, and get plenty of rest. I know a lot of times they like to have their bachelor parties, you know, the night before, and they just look horrible the next day. But, you know, maybe <laughs> make it two days before or something. There's, you know. And there's nothing wrong with having it maybe a week before. No, that's true. Put you know, there's a lot of that. finalizing to do the last week, and you've got to be, you know, on. Mm -hmm. Johnny on the spot. Right, yeah. Um, I would suggest to some grooms that when you're cutting the cake and you, you and your groom, uh, your bride, take a bite, uh, personally cut None a of couple of more pieces. <laughs> yeah. After you've cleaned yourself yes. off, you know, go um, uh, cut yourself a couple more pieces of cake and take them over to your new in laws. And she oh, should do the okay. same thing. It what is a such a nice, idea. respectful gesture. gesture. Yes. Yes, very now, respectful. normally, it's the groom's family that puts on the rehearsal dinner. Is this a time for the groom to shine when, you know, if there's any, you know, things they want to do that they do it at the rehearsal dinner since, since it's kind of the groom's family's deal? Yes, um, and um, I, uh, lots of appreciation should be shown. Mm -hmm. um, if the, uh, the bride who uh, is planning most of the wedding, he should show at that time his appreciation for all the hard work that she, and effort that she put into uh -huh. it. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah, it's always good to start off on the right <laughs> foot with the bride. I'm yes, guessing it's it not is. a bad idea. Yes, it so is. really, I think then what you're saying is appreciation is a big thing. Just those little touches, those little um, acts that you do that make a huge difference in people feeling included. Yes, yes. And uh, they can go to my website. I wrote an article on uh, Groom's Greater Clueless and <laughs> access that. And there's like 10 tips in there. So okay. that will really help you get through this Very planning nice. process. I yes. want to mention that this Saturday there is going to be a Brides Fair at the Red Lion mm -hmm. starting yes. at 10 o'clock. The Idaho so, Bridal Fair. And yeah. You can go to IdahoBridalFair.com uh -huh. and I'll you can go to there. your website too. Yes. And you will be at the Bridal Fair so if people need a little bit of information <laughs> about how to make everything go smoothly. Yes. Yes. Contact the Bridal Box. You want my card? Just <laughs> Fantastic. pick one up. Very right, good. Thanks, Dean. Right. Thank, Thank you. you. And coming up next on more, we're going to share your answers to the question of the day.